In this video, I'm going to show you how to deal with no-shows. Okay, so here we are back in the software, and um, as you can see over here <clears throat> in Opportunities, we had our uh, client pull test PMV due to come in at Friday. And if you need to show the account event, this is a little, little tip here. There you go, you can see the appointment there. So um, the really important uh, aspect here is not to put drag and drop into no-show here, even though you can do it here, but it's really important to actually go into your scheduling. So let's go to appointments. And so we'll see Paul test PMV here sitting here. So we go from confirmed and put into no-show. There we go. And if we go back into our conversations, and if we have a look at Paul, you'll see that that's fired off the no-show trigger funnel. Okay, so that's all working beautifully. And there's a message to my phone showing me that I've missed my class. And then the message sequence begins to follow up after that. So if, if Paul doesn't respond to me over the next you know, three or four days, he'll get three or four texts to remind him to book in another class with us. So that's how you do no-shows. I'll see you in the next video.